Hi everyone, welcome back, and today we're just going to be unboxing this. Okay, so the reason why I'm going to be making a dedicated video to this, I know I don't usually do this, but um, I decided this product deserves its own dedicated video. And the reason why, actually, is because... Uh, let me just finish opening this. It's hard to talk while I'm opening something. There we go. Okay. So, the reason why this video, I believe, deserves a dedicated unboxing and review on it is because this is supposedly supposedly I'm not sure but it's supposed to be a USB 3.0 hub and it's only uh, I think three dollars I got it on eBay it might have raised to five but I'm not sure it's a USB hub it's supposed to be USB 3.0 and on the picture these slots were green so I actually thought it was USB 3.0, but I'm seeing here it's white, so... It could just be they learned from Razer. It could be... It's a scam. It all depends. So I'm gonna go ahead and test the speeds on this and find out whether or not this is actually a USB 3.0 hub for only $3, or is it a USB 2.0 hub that they're scamming as a 3.0 hub and it's a normal price. So if this is a USB 3.0 hub it is pretty good. As you can see on the bottom you got the uh, it's not rubber but it's like anti-grip it does it slides it easily slides but it's not like it'll it'll slip off your desk easily not as good as rubber but it's good enough uh, it's definitely not metal it looks like metal in the picture but this is clearly plastic now that I have it in my hands. The wire is pretty thin. It can easily break, but again, it's as big as like your iPhone charging cable, so it's not too bad. I like the way it looks, and this angular design makes it so that if you have it on your desk for a laptop, it'll be in good access. And also, if, you, if you're the kind of person who does cable management, mounting this under your desk will be perfect because it'll make another angular design, so when you like have it under your desk, you could easily plug in stuff without like having to have it upside down or up so you don't have to worry about clearance. So I'm gonna go ahead and test the speeds on this and find out if this is real USB 3.0 or not so let me do that. I'll be right back. Okay so plugging my USB 3.0 SD card reader directly into my PC I averaged about 15 to 25 megabytes per second um, uh, write speed. Now we're going to compare that to this hub. Okay, so now using the USB 3.0 hub and the same USB 3.0 device, copying my video file went exactly the same. 25 to 15 megabytes per second write speed. So now I'm going to plug the hub into a USB 2.0 port and see if I still achieve those same speeds just to make sure that I'm not getting things wrong. Okay, so to no one's surprise, I was actually wrong in my uh, 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 guessing. Plugging the hub into the USB 2.0 device provided the same results, and I don't know what I was thinking, but USB 3.0 is definitely faster than 25 megabytes per second, so that's just my device. I'm using the wrong, de wrong device. Let's go ahead and get a bigger device that's faster and see if that'll work on USB 3.0 with this hub. Okay, so a quick Google search shows USB 3.0 speeds according to PC World. Of course, I should have known this, so let me go ahead and try something else now. Okay guys, so it turns out that this port is not a USB 3.0 hub. This is not to discourage you guys from looking at cheap things on eBay. There is, of course, a lot of cheap stuff on eBay that actually is really good, and someone is selling it for cheap for some reason. But this is not one of them. Uh, I did a quick, US, uh, quick search on Google, and I found how to tell apart a USB 2.0 from, from a 3.0 hub. I'll post an image up right here 
and I'll drop a source to their article in the description. But as you can see, this thing is read as a generic USB hub, and I looked into the details and it is not USB 3.0, in fact it is USB 2.0. However, you don't have to worry about getting ripped off because this is still a uh, fairly cheap USB 2.0 hub and so it's actually okay because I wasn't really caring if I got 3.0 hub or a 2.0 hub. All I saw was that this says it's 3.0 and it's cheap so I thought I might as well give it a try. But anyways, this video was not to show you guys that you should not buy these kind of cheap eBay stuff, it was actually just just to see if this was a cheap eBay thing, and it actually isn't. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. I'll see you guys uh, probably in the next video if you even watch that. Bye.